hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel uh, so today in this video we will see how we can upload files to our ec2 server which we have created in the last video uh, so what we will do is uh, we will i have this template and we will upload the files related to this template and we will see uh, it on the live url so let's get started so first of all uh, what we need to do is first of all we need to install filezilla you can download it from filezilla client and go to filezilla.org and download the filezilla client okay so after downloading it uh, what we need to do is uh, search for filezilla and open it and now we need to create a new site here okay now create a new site we will see new or we will name it as demo okay now from here in the protocol we need to choose ssh as we will connect through our pam file this is ssh okay so we need to add a host here and host is our ip address which we can get from our console go to ect and as you can see our one instance is running okay now copy the url here from here and in the login type you will use a key file and the user should be ubuntu and key file is which we have downloaded in the previous video while creating the server and you can use both the ppk or pam file we will use pam file this time click on open and click on connect Okay, as you can see, we are connecting connected to our server, server. So, for Apache's HTML directory is placed at slash var www slash html. So, all the files related to our website are uploaded in this directory. So, as you can see, we on currently we have a Apache default file. So what we need to do is we can delete it from here and now actually first of all we need to give the required permission to our html folder so we can uh, delete or add some new files okay so to give permission we need to connect with putty to our server so we need to do is let's connect it such or we can you you can also save a session put we can save it as demo and can save and here now to do password ssh auth and the ppk file session and save click on open okay now we need to cd into this directory cd slash var www click enter now we need to change the permission of this html folder which is currently this and to change the permission we have the command sudo chmode minus r space triple seven and the folder name html okay now the permission has been changed let's refresh it and as you can see permission has been changed and now we can delete this file from here and now we can upload the files of our project so we have i have these files let's select it select all and just put it here 
so as you can see all files are now uploading in the server Okay, now all the files are has been uploaded. Now let's check this. Currently we have this Apache default page. Let's hard refresh it with Control and F5. And yes, now our coming soon template is working on our live server. As you can see, it's here is a coming soon template. Okay, so in the next video we will see how we can <laughs> connect or server with a real domain like currently we are accessing through this IP address which is quite not decent and not able we cannot remember these things so what we will do is we will connect our server with a godaddy domain so we can type a domain name and it will hit and it will get these things for us using a domain so that's all for now don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel